So we type equal and lorem, then open bracket, and then you type a number. Now this first number is how many paragraphs you want in your fillet text. So let's say we wanted five paragraphs. Okay, then we type comma, and then you enter another number, and this is how many sentences you want to add per paragraph. So let's say we wanted to add a maximum of three sentences per paragraph, and then we close brackets. So as you can see, what we want to do is to add filler text and we want to add five paragraphs and only three sentences maximum per paragraph. So we've entered our function into Word and all we need to do now is to press enter to add filler text in Word. And as you can see, it's automatically added that filler text for us. So this will add filler text in Word um, in in any Word version um, that I I know. I think this has been available in Word since uh, the first iteration of Word version one. Um, and it's it's very simple simple to use. If you wanted to change the parameters, I'm just going to press Control and Z on my keyboard just to undo what we've done. If you wanted to change the parameters of your filler text, all you need to do is change the numbers. So you could have seven paragraphs and a maximum of four sentences per paragraph. And again, I'm just going to press enter on my keyboard. And as you can see, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six seven seven paragraphs with no more than three sentences now you might notice that some paragraphs don't have three sentences in them this well i think <laughs> i think most of them do actually but um if you'd change that to example let's change that again let's say to seven and two sentences and press enter on my keyboard so you can see um, you know there is a, a maximum of two sentences lorem ipsum text is a set text so some paragraphs do have only a couple of sentences in them so if you set your parameters for five paragraphs and eight sentences not all of your paragraphs will have eight sentences. So this is the way to add filler text and word. It's a very simple process. It's very easy to use and it does save you some time when you're setting out the parameters or the spatial parameters for your Word document. Okay, everybody. Thank you for watching Use My Box and I'll see you again on another video soon. Bye-bye.